goals and things like that are fine, but our goal is to get better each day, and then we'll take it one step at a time. Our goals is to have a good team, have a good season, come together as a team, and basically be a family. Hopefully, if we come together and play Trinity football, as do what we coach to do, the sky's the limit. The team is preparing for another run at a state crown, but they've still got plenty of work to put in if they're going to make it 12 titles in the last 16 years. Right now, you know, it's it's a it's a Forrest Gump and a box of chocolates. And as I say every year, until those lights come on on a Friday night, you really don't know. Standing in their way this year will be the usual 6A suspects, including the defending state champion Mill Bulldogs, the team that knocked Trinity out of the playoffs last season. I don't use a missed kick to motivate us, you know, and again, uh, it wasn't just that missed kick, you know, there were many other opportunities in that game. Oh, for sure. That's that's definitely in the back of our heads. That was one of the toughest losses we've ever taken. The Rocks know they'll get everyone's best, and that's why they're busy with their own challenges, starting their journey for another gold ball. I think our key word this year with our football team is perform. You know, you perform, you're going to have your chance, and then when you get your chance, then you have to perform. I just feel like if we come together and do what we're supposed to do, I think we, could, we won't have a weak spot. I just think we just got to come together, follow the game plan, and we should be okay.